Hello and welcome to another update. In this one, I'll be covering the front line, starting out in the Donetsk front. We see that the Russian forces are attacking the direction of Marinka through the center, the southern part, then the northern parts. In the southern part, they're attacking the direction of Pobieda, while in the northern part, they're looking to envelop this city from the north, reaching the river line here. They've entrenched themselves within the warehouses and uh, such buildings here in the north, and then they are fighting, trying to take control over the area before moving southwards. As for Pervomaisk area, we see that the Russian forces are attacking in the direction of Nevelske, as well as Pervomaisk itself from the central direction and the northern direction here, as well as fighting continues in Vodiane, as well as in the direction of Shiverne, where they are attacking these entrenched areas to the north. And to the southeast of Avdivka, fighting continues in this direction, as well as to the northeast in the direction of Kamyanka, as well as Krasnohorivka. As for the Bakhmut front, we see here that the Russian forces are attacking on the whole front line as they're attacking in the hill area to the southwest of Ivanivska, as well as in the direction of Ivanivska itself uh, to the south of it. And here to the eastern part, the fighting continues in the residential area to the southwest, as well as towards the uh, road inter intersection. And then we see here the cemetery area fighting continues here in this direction as well, and to the south in the direction of the canal. And then we see here that the Russian forces are also attacking in the east of the city, trying to gain control over the east of the Bakhmutovka River, which seems to have been uh, retreated from by the Ukrainian forces. They have left the eastern bank of the Bakhmutovka River. And then the Russian forces are also attacking from the north of the city as they try to cross the river line here and take control over the western bank of the river line to the west as it goes through here this forested area. And then to the southwest of that, the Russian forces continue their attacks in the direction of Homove as they try to take control over the road between Bermud and Jezevyar, which is unusable because the Ukrainians or Russians blew up this bridge here. Then we see fighting here by the rail lines, where the Wagner is using that as their road to advance towards Jezevyar. And at the same time, they are attacking uh, southwards using these roads to reach the road between uh, Bermud and Jezevyar. Then there's also been reported fighting in the direction of Bohdanivka, as well as Hryhorivka and Orihova Vesilivka, as the Russian forces advance here by the uh, Dubova Vesilivka area and are trying to advance towards these villages. Then we also see fighting continued in the direction of Sleshnyansky, as well as Vesyukivka and Fedorivka, as Russian forces are trying here to advance and gain greater position by the river line, as well as to the northern direction of Siversk. As for the Siversk front or Kriminna front, the Russian forces are attacking the direction of Pilohorivka as well as the southern forests in the southwest of Kriminna as they try to gain control over these areas as it will allow them to get a better position uh, to defend Kriminna. And the final report is that the Russian forces are attacking the direction of Nevsky as they try to gain control over the river line between the Ukrainian and Russian positions. So just like this. And that is all for this quick update. Thanks for watching, hope you all enjoyed and have a great day.